You're a goofball. Welcome back to the channel. Ladies and gentlemen, how's your day going? I hope you're doing spectacular. I got uh, on tubing. It's got quite the little crunch right there. So hopefully that doesn't determine what's going to be like inside the tube. So let's cut this open. Get into it. I'm, you guys are probably guessing. Oh, it's an ever moment. You are correct. It is an ever moment. Ever moment. I hope everybody's having a spectacular day. My day's been... Eh, it could be better. A lot of bullshit going on right now. I will talk a little bit about that here when, when I get done with this video. Fill you guys in so I'm not leaving you out. Oh, what a crunch. Crunch. Somebody freaking drop kick it. Sheesh, people. Don't break a nail. I have brittle nails. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I got diamonds falling out everywhere. And goodies. Oh, man. That is crunched right on top of the diamond paint. That's not good. Let's see if I can get this out of this tube. Let's see. You guys can get a good angle on it. Oh, it's crunched. Come on now. I know you don't want to come out of there because you got that crunch in the tube. All right. If I squeeze the tube and take the crunch out, the painting comes out. So, it don't feel like it's too terribly bad. So, I'm just going to leave that sit there. We're going to... Yeah, I'm wearing long sleeve, y'all. Hey, get off of my freaking new trim in my craft room, you little psycho cat. So, you get washi tape says ever moment on it that'll go in my washi tape container you get a big old wazoo bag of drills or drills bags last time there was enough bags there to do the whole job if i want to bag them this one i'll probably put in my harbor freights drills look stunning as usual Oh, you can see the size, 40 by 60, 43 colors. God, I love Evermoment squares. They are so freaking nice. So, um, let's start with the toolkit. I'll tell you why I'm wearing a long sleeve shirt, because it went from being 100 degrees down to like 67 degrees today. Yeah, my little 125 pound ass is cold. So you got your standard pin, single placer, three placer, and a pink squishy, or purple squishy. You got, whoa, they gave me two chunks of wax. A white boat. Oh, you guys know I don't use these, because I have this big guy. This big guy that I'm using for trash drills. I have like five or six of them I don't even use. These small white ones. Your nice ever moment tweezers that are sharper than Satan's Patushi. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm, I'm in a weird mood, y'all. So, 
I'm just gonna set this off the side and kind of hopefully let it unravel over here by itself, not forcing it to do anything. We're gonna get into these drills over here. I, I really don't want to take these out of these bags because they package it so nicely. And there's a boatload here. What's this? Ever moment. Oh, they put a statement of diamonds we are using. Different diamonds made from resin and acrylic. Hmm. Wow, acrylic diamonds are half as cheap as the resin diamonds. That's kind of crazy. Hey, leave my diamond painting alone, you little hooch. Swear, I can't do nothing with this God bless American cat. So, Forty-three colors. Or just in the count. Actually, I'm going to pause you guys so you don't have to wait through this because this may take me a few. So, I'll be back when I got it all done. Okay, I have everything in the second bag accounted for, checked off. I'm going to go ahead and pause you guys and hurry through the second one. And... I'll be right back. So there is bag number one. Completely accounted for. Everything is here. Diamond wise. So we're just going to go ahead and pick this up. And put this back into this bag. Ever so nicely. Never can get it back in the bag how they had it in the bag. All right, you guys ready for this canvas? I'm interested in seeing it myself. I need to go find some parchment paper because I do not like this cover. I'm not a fan of double-sided adhesive, but when you guys see this image, you will know what is going down. Major wrinkle over there, but I'm sure that's just a cover. So let's go ahead and see. This is in two pieces. Let's see how well they splice this. I don't know which side is top, which side is bottom. No, don't do it. Started a rip on me. So where it's overlapping. I hate this kind of stuff. I'm glad Diamond Art Club is starting to do customs. I'm glad Treasure Studios Arts does customs. Oh. I can get that to not rip there, or it's got some rivering going on.
definitely got a river over here. But I think I could fix that. I've watched plenty enough people fix them. I've never personally had to fix one myself because I started out with Bam Narclo, thanks to my YouTube homegirl Redneck Beauty. So I got spoiled with all the goodness. I see what it is. It's the witch house for Halloween Hollow Mass. So, Diamond Art Addiction, you guys know, I call her Sister Addiction. Uh, she is doing a Hollow Mass just like this. It's not a once in a year thing. It's a it's a tradition. It's like a whole month long with me. Halloween's like a month of of Halloween. It's just me. My, my family's been like that for a long time. When Halloween comes around, it's like a whole month long of goodies. So there is some major issues with the canvas where it was straighten your life up over here. There's some bubbling going on right here and here. It's where the Canvas got crunched. There's a river up here. Besides that, it looks pretty good. I'm going to have to doctor it up a little bit. But nothing terrible. It is stickier and sticky. That is for sure. So, don't want to mean to put you down there, deep down in the face of things, but I wanted you guys to see exactly what it looks like. I think it'll be fine because the doctoring that I just did definitely seems to help. Definitely sticky. Sticky, sticky, sticky. While I am straightening this out, trying to get all the bubbles out to make sure it's laying down nice and flat, I want to talk to you guys about my shout out videos. It's not a very fun subject with me right now because I got an email from YouTube, um, basically somebody reported me to YouTube for some shit. I ain't gonna put no names out there and I'm not even gonna say what it's about, but what I'm going to say is my shout out videos will be no longer. YouTube is cracking down on people who are doing shout outs. They're thinking, they're calling it spam. So if you are doing shout outs, stop. 
because you have the chance of going under review. And if you go under review and they think they you have spam videos on your YouTube, they will delete your channel. No joke. That's exactly what it says in the email that was sent to me. I got it. I got three emails within an hour. One was for my shout outs. One, somebody reported me for some stupid bullshit. And then the other one was stupid bullshit. I've said from the beginning, don't bring drama to me. I don't want drama. I'm not in high school no more. If I have said something to you to offend you, come to me. Don't go saying shit to other people because that beef you have is with me and we need to talk and we'll settle it. But for you to go and talk and shit to other people and then report me to YouTube, that just shows how childish you really are. I think it'll be okay. I'm going to take it and put it underneath my bed so it'll get nice and flattened out. So as soon as the squirrel collab with Sister Addiction, that shall be fun to see. So when the squirrels are done, I'm starting this so I can get it up, hopefully, and completed by... Easter. Oh, good God. Halloween. What am I thinking? I'm thinking Easter candy. <sighs> I, I'm, I'm addicted to candy. I like all the, the little um, holidays that have candies involved. Um, my favorite one is Valentine's Day. You get those little Brock's hearts. Oh, to die for. So I'm going to pause you guys for one second. I'm going to go grab something to show you guys. I'll be right back. Okay. So I don't know if you remember or not, but I said I was getting a coloring book in on Monday. I got it. And I want to share a flip through with you guys. I, I don't want to make it extremely long, but... I am going to be doing a coloring video probably Thursday out of this book. So I personally haven't looked at it besides the cover. So let's go ahead and bring you guys down. So it's called Inky Galaxy by Ellen or Helen Ellingston. It is absolutely cuter than cute. Yeah, I haven't even folded that spine over. Get a good s s fold in it. So it's got lots of cool pictures for coloring. Uh, this lighting sucks. Let me pull this around. There we go. So I will be picking out a page out of this. This, this paper is super, super thin, but that's okay. I will take it and I'll put it in my copy machine. I wish there was a face, but oh well. And I'll make a copy of it. Ooh, she's pretty. She's like a, a um, there's like little alien faces in the gravel. So she's like the alien queen. I don't know. But there was some cool stuff in here that I liked. Some of them I wasn't so fond of. I thought this one was cool. There was only a couple pictures that 
that I seen when I was picking this out on Amazon. Yeah, just like aliens. Okay, so that's weird. There's like babies, but they have an elephant and aliens, and then they have like an umbilical cord. Is it supposed to be a balloon? I don't know. And a cat. But there was some cool ones on here that I really liked from seeing the pictures. Oh, I like that. It's got a doggy. That's cool. It's got butterflies. So this is one of the ones that I really liked that I seen that they showed. This one, I loved this one. I'll show you it on the back page of what it looks like when somebody colored it. It's like space. I love it. It's actually really cool. I gotta take it to work and make some copies. Look at that. She's, she's gorgeous. Get you up in that business. She says, how you doing? Oh, a wolf with mouse on his back. Okay, that's kind of cool. I know, some of y'all probably like, I don't like coloring. Well, guess what? I like it. It's ice cream, but it's got the planets and the ice cream. Nice. I like ice cream. I, that's what I used to call it when I was a little kid. I used to, I couldn't say ice cream. I used to say ice cream. So I still say it to this day. Ice cream. <sighs> Those were the things that my mom would be like, it's called ice cream. <laughs> Same with hot dogs. I used to call hot dogs dot dogs. It's a uh, Superman. He's saving the planet. Okay, that's kind of cool. I like all the um, think, think, think. The hell is that stuff called? It's like a Paisley print. That's what I'm thinking of. I just smacked myself upside the head a couple of times to think about that. Eh, there's not a lot in here that I like, but there is a few in here that I like. I'm not even seeing the one that I like the best. It might be at the at the back. Oh, this one. I love this one. He's skateboarding. That's awesome. I'll show you guys this on, on the back completed. It's freaking awesome. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, that's pretty cool. She's got a hooter. I'm guessing that's like a backpack. Or it's just in, in her shirt. I don't know. It looks like it's built into her shirt. I like how it's got the stars and the earths and the planets. I'm guessing this is her purse floating in the air. Oh yeah, that's cool. I like how it's got the chain around it. That's cool. If that picture is 
not in here. I'm going to be pissed. Oh, I guess that's what I was looking at. So, there's that one all colored up. And then the skateboarder dude. And then her. But that's it. I will be picking out a page of this and I will be doing some coloring in it this week. I'm going to try to do a video. Let's see. What do I like? Tell me what page you guys like the best. I don't even remember which one I like. Let's see. I don't know. You guys tell me what you liked about the book and what page you thought was cool. I wish this picture was in there because I love how it's got the windmill on top of the earth. It says planet for sale. <laughs> That's hilarious. But this was the first um, galaxy coloring book that I can find. It's more of like a kid coloring book, but, oh, she's from the UK. That's cool. I'll pick a picture out and I'll be coloring with that this week. That's all I have for you guys today. Um, I do want to say if my channel does go under review because of what happened, and YouTube decides to delete my channel and you guys are looking for me and it's gone. Well, I have no no way of stopping that from happening. It's just going to happen. If it does happen, I will be opening another channel and starting all over again. But whatever, I don't care. If it happens, it happens. Nothing I did wrong. So... It is what it is. So, I appreciate everybody. Remember, you got to have your peace. And treat each other how you want to be treated. And I hope you get that same respect back. Have a great day, everybody.